Hello and welcome back to Let's Play Grand Ages Room with me, Grey Hunter, where we're about to pass beyond my gameplay knowledge of the game, because obviously I've only played up to Divide and Conquer. We just finished Divide and Conquer. Woo! And now we're on to the mission with uh, Caesar to break the Siege of Alexandria. So, while this is beyond my personal gameplay knowledge of the game, I have actually watched, and I apologize in advance for getting this wrong, because I may, I may mess up the pronunciation. Uh, I have watched New Sensei's um, LP of the game, and you've probably seen him comment a couple of times on the series, and that's really cool. Hello, I sees you. Hello. Um, <laughs> so I reckon that's really awesome, and I will say I love his series of Grand Ages Rome. It's it's really good, actually, seeing somebody who plays very different, usually, to what you play. So while he's utilitarian, I'm more of an aesthetic sort of person. So it's it's a lot of fun, and it's one of the things that really draws me to LPing, I find, is that, you know, you can see people doing different stuff, playing the same game you play, but playing it way different to the way you play it, because, you know, that's how it works. People play games differently. But, um, yeah, his series is really, really good, and I urge you, if you haven't checked it out already, to check it out. There's very few Grand Ages Rome uh, LP series, so it probably shows up in the um, recommended viewing section, you know, the, the videos that are recommended. So it probably shows up there, but um, in case it doesn't, I'm going to include a link to his channel in the description for this one. So check him out, because he's awesome at the game. And he did a couple of other series which are really cool, like uh, Medal of Honor Pacific Assault. But anyway, anyway, getting on to the game. So the Siege of Alexandria. Caesar, what's up? Salve, my dear friend. Yo. How I mourn the death of Pompey. He was a great man, a consul of Rome, but above all, a good friend. Seems I like wish he would have dick, surrendered actually. after Pharsalus like Brutus and Cicero, but he was too proud to see reason. Cylon. Now we have other worries at hand. I have decided to name Queen Cleopatra the rightful ruler of Egypt. Her brother disagrees and has besieged the capital of Alexandria. You will lift the siege and secure the region. Yes, yes, we will do this for you, Caesar. We will do this. So, our objective is to destroy all enemy camps and not let the library fall. So, bonus objectives being to win a mission without losing a squad. That's fairly normal for a military mission. And win the mission without losing the lighthouse. That one should be easy as can be, because the lighthouse is like at the very back of the city, as far as I remember from watching a new sensei's videos. So, let us begin. Sorry, now Alexandria for this one. This is kind of cool. I'm just gonna pause it here for a moment. I want to see what sort of a shambles Caesar has left us with. So he's left us with some buildings that aren't running. What have we got, employment-wise? Okay, we've got some bards. They need patricians. So if we click start, that should move somebody over. And we can swap that to plebs. That works for me. Okay, so we're at 94%. This needs an equite. We'll deal with that in a minute. This can start work. Alright, 97%. That's good. You don't have a job. Uh, if I can place this, you do now. Oh right, we should uh, we should do this. Get our Praetorians all up and running. And we've got some Triarii, which is kind of nice. We've got some Triarii and we've got some Pistardi, so that's always handy. We'll get another squad of Pistardi. 22 seconds, I love it. And they'll start with an extra level too, which is brilliant. Okay, so we've got a couple of buildings that aren't working. We need Equites. Equites, Equites, so that makes our build order fairly simple actually. Uh, one Equite house to run that. Where can you go? Will you be in range? You will be in range. One Equite to run that. One Equite to run this. That should settle everything up. And we want archers. Well, I want archers, just because I like having that uh, ranged element. So we'll get a weaponsmith. Actually, first barracks. Where can you... Okay, you reach out to here. So we should be able to fit 
Ooh, I wonder, could we get Cav as well? Probably. Alright, our stable's there. And the weaponsmith. There. They should both be in range. Yes, yes, no. Um. Oh, right, they're not running yet. Um. So we need one equite for that. I'm just going to unpause it for a second, see what's going on. Okay, so we've got 100% employment, you're running. Ah, the port's not. Okay, so if we place another equite there, it's one for you, one for you. So the stables is running, which means we can get Cav. That would be kind of cool, but uh, I don't want them yet. We'll get them soon. Right now I want to focus on infantry, because infantry and archers are very important, because we've got a camp sitting out here. Fun. Research. We are the Flavii, why are we not researching? Because I am a derp, but if you've watched my videos up to this point, you already knew that. There we go. Okay. So Caesar did give us somewhat of a dodgy city. But we've managed to make it work fairly well. Got stone walls researched, always good. And we've got a port so we can start uh, bringing stuff in if we need it. I'm thinking that we might get some iron later because we've got a ton of recruits, but not as much iron as we could use. So I want you guys to rally over to here, and you should be done. Oh, it doesn't apply to you guys, obviously. I thought um, our talent would have the time for that too, but apparently not. What do we just get? Not the research thing, the other thing. Why did our farm change? Ah, uh, research master. Okay. Cool. Ooh, if we build one more house, we'll have 40. I'm tempted. I'm very tempted. Well, let's have a look. Religious satisfaction's fairly high. Now, what are you guys doing? Hello, Nubian warriors. Hmm. I wonder, could we fit a prefecture in here? Because if we could, we could probably cut down on the, um... Oh. Wait! We can fit one there. Can we fit an Equite house in with it? Oh yes. Now, if I remember correctly, this will reduce the iron requirement for this building. Hopefully. Hopefully. Which would give us a little bit more iron to use, no? Oh, Prefecture's not good. No? Maybe it doesn't work exactly the way I thought it did. Okay, well, we can work with that. So we want the Hastati and the Praetorians together as group number one. We want the Archers together as group number two. And we want you guys as group number three as the Missile Soakers. So we'll send the... Hmm. Actually, the Nubians will probably be taken care of. This is a worry. But they're currently not attacking, so... Might wait until the Nubians are taken down, just in case the catapults advance, because they might. Aw, oh, dick. Dick move, guys. Dick move. But you're bringing the catapults in closer, so attack. You guys scare them off. I want to demoralize those catapults, and oh god, they, f they hit hard, they hit very hard, I don't like it. Kill, 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 kill. Kill them. Ah shit, run away. <laughs> that, that did not go well. Well, it went sort of well, I mean, we took out those guys, so that, that's a plus. Um, let's move our forces out here, actually seeing as the catapults aren't a worry anymore. And we'll build ourselves a military camp here-ish, somewhere. There, that'll do. So let's move folks over that way. I don't think we can do anything with these guys just yet. And really, I'd rather face them with the cav than not. So let's use this port, seeing as we've got it running buy some iron. 35 iron? That seems a little over the top. But we're still earning some money. I guess we'll get the lighthouse to, um... Oh, I guess we can't. Ah, fuck! 
Kill them all. Get in there, get in there. Obviously we went too close. But uh, that does actually give us an advantage. We can now run up there, get rid of it, and we didn't lose anybody, so that's always good. There's the subjugated. Count. Yes. Alright, run away again. <laughs> Bravely brave Sir Robin. Run like hell. Okay, that's good. That is actually really, really good, because I was concerned for a minute there that we would probably lose somebody. So, now we can get ourselves some cavalry. We haven't really used cavalry all that much in the um, whole game. We haven't really used cavalry all that much in this game. But um, seeing as we've got the iron and we've got the money, I mean, we're making a fair bit of bank. I think we finished our research too, yeah. So let's do a few more researches, the really easy ones, mainly to get us extra money. And we need two more... Researchers to get starter, so let's get Germans and Celts. Nice. Cool. And we've also got the population thing done, so that's always nice. And the forum is upgraded with a fair bit of stuff, actually. It's pretty cool. So our Praetorians and such are getting refitted. Awesome. So what are we looking at in experience? Pretty good level, actually. Nice. And of course, remember that we've got the Veterani talent as well, so we get a little bit extra on top of what we already had. So I'm going to advance our forces over this way. I'm going to put the Triari over here, and then we're going to move the cavalry as their own separate unit over to here. Hopefully what we can do is we can catch the um, catapults with the cav and the Nubians and etc. can be taken out with our infantry. I might want to get a bit more infantry, actually. Uh, let's move our cab back a bit. Just a little. Actually, let's move the cab over here. Okay, let's not. Okay, they are reforming to face us, so if we keep moving our infantry such over this way, that should make it easier for our cavalry to get over here. Sort of, a little bit, not so much. Okay, well the cav are still doing their job, they're distracting the enemy. Which is nice. I'd really, really like... Okay, what are you doing now? Are you going to be within range? I don't think so. Okay, let's move you over here. Oh, Jesus! <laughs> I didn't notice there was another camp there. Okay, let's not move you guys over there. That, that could be very, very bad, actually. Oh, shit! They're coming. Run away! Bravely brave Sir Robin. I didn't see that happening. I didn't realize that they were over here and they've got elephants. Hooray! Elephants. My favorite. Alright, we need another one of these to replenish the losses. Not so glorious. Um, well the cavalry are okay. I mean, we could, I guess, run over this way and try to do something. With the cav. Actually, you know what? We are. We're gonna go over this way. See if we can't burn that camp simply by being over there. Nope, run away. Alright, mobility. Mobility me. Hit that. Oh god. Okay, cavalry. Um, it might be time to run. Run! Attack. Catapults. Three out of four. Oh, balls. Okay, attack them. Those catapults are our danger. Kill, kill. Oh, 
god. Ow, that hurt. Uh, cavalry. You know you're meant to be killing those. Right, there you go. There we go. That's much better. Alright, now we're getting work done. Milestone has been lost. Meh. Don't care. Things have been killed. Things that are not me have been killed. This is a plus. Alright, so cavalry unit that's in no way damaged whatsoever. Go kill them. And you guys hang out over here. Cavalry unit that is damaged, get over there. Oh. Put the tree REI into their hole thingy. Oops. <laughs> Oh dear. Alright, so kill, kill. War camp hostile, war camp subjugated bitches. A milestone has been captured. Nice. Alrighty, so what have we got in terms of resources? We've got. No, not those. 22 iron to spare. We actually have a fair few recruits left over, so. I wonder, could we build ourselves an arena? and get some Secutores, because they were actually fairly good at taking down the elephants when we went to, um, that place with elephants. That I can't remember the name of now. Ankyra! That's the one. They're actually fairly good. So, that'll use up some of our slaves, and I know we need to research it. So let's go to the researchy thingy. Uh, Secutores, and Spatha, marching formation. Okay, cool. Was there a time limit on this mission? I don't remember. No. Just uh, don't get people killed. Take the place. Kill everything. Sounds like a plan to me. Alright. So we will need to build a road. A bridge, sorry. Uh, over this. So build like so. And then move our forces across here. Because... There is... A camp up here, and a camp over here. I want to deal with them separately. And let's see. What have you got? You've got six squads in total. It looks like you don't have any catapults or anything like that, because you've got a large number of troops. You guys, on the other hand... Oh, three squads. Okay. Well, that's easy enough. Let's do that. I like that plan. And we'll uh, we'll get some Astarte to guard the home front. So we'll uh, put them there. And do we have Secretores available? No, but we can recruit Gladiators. I wonder, are Gladiators very good? What does help have to say? No. No, 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 no. Military. Uh, units. There we go. The Gladiators. Gladiators. Where are you? There you are. What are you good at? They become invincible for 30 seconds. They wear no armor, but they take. They do deal colossal damage. They take no damage penalty from being demoralized. That is plus. What about Secutores? Are they better than the Gladiators? They take up iron. But they deal double damage. They take double damage, though. Hmm. I think we'll go with a unit of each. Oh, we can't get a unit of each because we don't have enough iron. God damn it! Um, I suppose we could build a... Um, a trade post and gain some iron, but... Nah. Not worth it. We'll just go with the gladiators. The gladiators actually seem like the better choice anyway. So what are we facing here? Bow maidens, bow maidens, bow maidens, and bow maidens. Attack! Charge! Kill them all. Cavalry, attack! You know what, there's absolutely no point in going in Testudo actually, so just, just attack. Attack. Ah. 
Okay, so that should be three caps. Yep, three. And then we'll take these guys out next. Ah, I wish this had a, um, a thing like Rome Total War does, where you can see where you put everything by tapping spacebar, but cannot. Okie dokie. So we could disband this Astadi. In fact, we might to get um, to get some Secretores, but it's it seems to me that this would actually be better because the gladiators become invincible for 30 seconds and then they become disbanded. But that surely wouldn't count as losing a squad, would it? If you disband them as opposed to them being killed off, surely it would not count. But I could be wrong, it has happened before. You've got gladiators, you bastards. I wonder. Would we build a siege workshop and attack them? It is a siege workshop in this, isn't it? Yes, it is. So it requires a siege workshop technology, which we could get. So, siege workshop. I mean, there's no rush to finish this mission, so we might as well. And I mean, we've got to wait for uh, these folks to be retrained, or at least uh, refitted with men. You are doing that, right? Plus, Time Teachers is excellent. It's excellent, and it's worth waiting a little bit to get your squads up to higher levels. So, there we go. The archers are at level 11 and 12. Well, almost 12. The Hastadi, for some reason, are not refilling. But even the Equestri, who haven't really done all that much, are still getting some benefit. That's always good. Go there. Maybe that'll help. No, apparently nobody's coming out of the thing. Hmm. Intriguing. The marching formation has been finished, which makes me happy in the pants. These gladiators, on the other hand, do not. Level 1, though. They're only level 1, but... Didn't it say that they don't... Yeah, they take no morale pen penalty, so our demoralization wouldn't be as effective. Light infantry. I'm going to try something. Which is kind of stupid. But I think if we moved our cannon around, we use mobility, surely they would go faster. Okay, there we go. So they won't get shot. But they're drawing the enemy out as well. Uh -huh. Maybe now these guys will actually refill. Yeah, I think it was enemy presence that was stopping them from doing so. But I wonder if we could then... Simply... Oh, no, we can't. They turned around. Okay, so no research goal, which will actually net us a lot of money. I remember right. Well, 517 is not too bad. Hmm. Victorians, nah. Let's go for some of the easy ones here. Okay, so we can build a siege workshop now. What can we build with the siege workshop? And what does it require? Produces ballistae squad that require iron. How much iron is the question? Build it there? We can build it there. Some builder camps too. One, two, three. Alright, so what are we facing off against? We're facing off against Nubians and one, two, three units of gladiators. Maybe four. No, four units of gladiators. The Nubians are actually the easy ones. They're the easy guys to take care of. Gladiators are dangerous. Damn. Well, how much does it cost? You need a carpenter shop in the area to build one. God damn it! We just keep needing stuff. Um, can we build a Equite here-ish? No, the terrain is too steep. That here. No, oh, there's already a building, so no. <laughs> you can't build on top of a building. But buildception! Okay, can we get the carpenters? Requires more wood. 
we have a lumber camp. We do have a lumber camp. Give me more wood. Give me lots more wood. And a carpenter shop to go. There. Yes, we destroyed part of our wall, but it's okay. We've got an army that uh, stopped people from coming to attack us, so we don't have to worry so much. I'm, I'm contemplating just uh, running in and trying to take them all out. I mean, we've got the advantage of numbers. I suppose we could do it. We have the number advantage. But I sort of want to see if we can get um, some heavy artillery. We can. Gimme. Gimme, gimme, gimme. I want some heavy artillery to help me out with this one. You bastards had catapults last time? Let's see how you like it with a ballista. Oh, but it'll take a minute to um to build up. Well that's okay. That's actually fine. I'm a bit worried about these guys though. They've got six squads too, but they're one of their squads, or at least one of them, is elephants. And I do not like elephants. Elephants do not make me happy in the pants. Elephants make me really sad, actually, because they're so bloody tough. Hmm. Well, it could be a lot worse. I mean, average food satisfaction is actually really high, considering, you know, like, the state of the city that Caesar gave us. Which was not good, by the way. I'm not forgiving you for that yet, Caesar. Now, let's seek trade routes, see if we can get a bit more iron, because I would like some. I also considered using um, the Intimidate Barbarians thing, but Intimidating Barbarians doesn't actually help if they're not going to be demoralized. Unless... Unless this overrides that. That whole no morale penalty thing. I do not know, but I want to see if these Ballista in action, so... Uh, let's do it. What can they do? Greek Fire. Ooh, area attack damage. Yes. Yes. Okay, sorry guys, you're going to have to wait for uh, the whole ballista thing to come up. God, they move slow. Oh well. Could be worse. So, a new trade route will be available in the one year. Let's see, is there anything better for iron? Yeah? Yeah? Let's go with that one. Start trade. So how much money are we making now? 303. That's more than enough. We could get another unit of gladiators. Which I'm going to do, because uh, the gladiators we can throw in first. When it comes to actually attacking. Yeah. Yeah, I like this. Okay, so we're spending a fair bit of money on iron, and yes, we are taking a little bit of extra time, but I'd like to, you know, this is a military mission where you've really got the ability to explore all your options, and I like that sort of thing, so we're going to do it my way. I'm the one with the, uh, the, the LPing set up, so, uh, you know, hey, you guys have to watch what I want. <laughs> I'm the one with the mouse and the keyboard, biatches. Nah, I love you all. I love you all. You make me happy because, you know, somebody's watching what I make. It's cool. I reckon that's pretty cool. And I figure if I'm having fun with it, you know, you guys are going to have more fun watching me. So, I'm having fun. I, wa I want to I want to explore our options. I mean, just the thought of a ballista being like, hey, Greek fire, bitches. That, that sounds pretty cool to me. Plus, you know, combined arms and all that cavalry coming in from the rear with mobility restored so they can run in and just wreak havoc with the Nubians. I like it. I like it a lot. Hello gladiators. I'm seeing that these gladiators could be very very useful assuming they don't count towards destroyed squad things because they've got that whole uh, ability to be invincible for 30 seconds? 30 seconds? Yeah. So assuming we sent them in first they could actually do a fair bit of damage. Especially if they sit here for a while and gain levels because look they're already level 7. These guys, they're level 11. This is actually seeming like a really, really good idea. Now, 
What's the range on this? I, I guess we don't know. There? You have to advance. Ah, but you can stand behind the triari. That seems like a good option. Oh yeah! Okay. Intimidate barbarians. Everyone, attack! Cavalry, get in here! Ah, fudge pumps, run away! Okay, everyone attack them! Cavalry, get over here! You guys, keep running! Cavalry, mobility me! Get in there! No! No! Ballista! You're going to ruin everything! No! You ruined everything! Okay, we don't get the bonus for uh, being awesome, but that's okay. We got to try out extra stuff. And that's always fun. There we go! Run, little bitches! Oh yeah! Okay, so we lost the objective, the bonus objective. I would have preferred to get it, but, you know, it's not about the bonus objectives. It's not all about them, anyway. They are fun to get, or at least try to get. But, uh, yeah. And I guess, realistically, those ballista would have slowed everything down. I suppose. Fine. But yeah, it was a lot of fun, it was fun, I liked doing that, it was kind of cool. So we'll add you guys to group number one. Group one, you guys can hang out here. And then group number two can hang out here behind you. And the Triari can go over there, and the Cavalry can go over there. And the Gladiators... Ooh, oh, look at that. Can be cannon fodder, go here. Okay. Yeah, I, I like this. I like this idea. I don't like you. You are annoying me. But we've got authority as well to, um, to demoralize them. So I'm going to intimidate them again. Select barbarian village. Yeah, I did that. Oh, okay, there we go. It meant select, select. Not pretend, select. So you guys get over here. You guys over there. You guys over there. Cavalry, you can stay where you are. Gladiator. Fight! Okay, so we want them to take on those elephants. What have they got? They've got Nubian warriors, Nubian warriors. War elephants hanging out in front, and they've got some gladiators. They've also got some catapults. My favorite. Love catapults. Bastards. You know what? Seeing as we're so close, I'm gonna get another ballista. Can we not get another Oh, right. Uh, the whole, um,. People thing. We need more of them. We must construct additional people. Right. Go like that. Hmm. I'm tempted to just throw it in as an all-out attack sort of thing, because I mean we've already lost the uh, the bonus objective. These guys are demoralized. Gladiators, you're up. Okay, we don't want to pop the gladiator's ability too quick. Until they're close enough, so... Now, I guess. Attack! Kill! Alright, gladiators, kill, kill, kill. Get on it. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Cavalry, what are you doing? Oh right, you were doing exactly what I told you to do by being over there. I'm an idiot. <laughs> God damn it! Does my derp no no bounds? Am I not merciful? Am I not derpy? Bitches be conquered. Charge. I'm amused that the only squad we actually lost was the Ballista because it didn't have the ability to outrun what was attacking it. We actually did fine. 
God damn it. Okay, we can get killed, please. Oh God, it's the elephant. All right, fine. Hooray. Victory. Sweet. Cool. So now we've got a couple of extra missions coming up, which is nice. But that will wait until next time. So I shall see you in the next video. And thank you for watching.